Hey, what's up, y'all? And well, as you may have heard, some uh, bad news uh, for the uh, Georgia Bulldogs. Um, offensive coordinator Todd Munkin um, is uh, moving is moving on after three years. He's going to be the offensive coordinator of the Baltimore Ravens. I mean, yeah, no surprise here. Uh, we should have seen this coming. Seems like uh, like he never stays somewhere for more than three years. That seems to be his average um, length of stay before moving on. That That's what he does. He's very um, nomadic, right? He does not like to stay in the same place very long. He likes to... Um, uh, to uh, roam around, so we should have seen this coming. Especially when when he interviewed, yeah, why would you, you know, you know, interview for two NFL positions with the Ravens and the Buccaneers if you weren't going to take um, an NFL job? Obviously, you know, I, I was hoping that he that he would stay, but again, um, um, Todd Munkin just likes to you know, move around from job to job for, um, n for, um, n no good reason at all. So, I mean, you know what, Todd, I mean, you could have stayed and, and, and we could have, um, three-peated, uh, maybe. I mean, you're not going to win a Super Bowl, um, in Baltimore. That's just the way it is. You'd have a much better chance at winning a championship staying at UGA, but whatever. Um, and, um, yeah, so three years, two national championships, and, and, you're, and, and you're just going to walk away. Um, but, yeah, but anyway, so... Um, so now, so now, why would you want to go to the Ravens? I mean, they they don't even know um, who their quarterback is going to be next year. I mean, um, um, L L Lamar Jackson is leaving. I mean, yeah, he's um, mum 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 going uh, to the Falcons. So we, what you going to do? You're going to start start um, Ty Tyler Huntley. Yeah, do you really want you really want to go want to go to the Baltimore Ravens um, to coach um, Tyler Huntley? Yeah, Tyler Huntley offense, man. The uh, uh, the Ravens offense was just it was just terrible. They were just they were just garbage. Uh, they were com they were complete just hot doo doo uh, with them. Um, Tyler Huntley at quarterback once um once um Lamar Jackson was injured and and Todd Munkin says that yeah that's he says yeah that's my guy um yeah I know that that y'all want to say that maybe he just um he just um my mom my mom left because because he doesn't have his favorite quarterback uh Stetson Bennett anymore. Yeah, for some reason, uh there have been a lot of um mum 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 police cars um going down my road uh for the past um for yeah, for the past um half hour there's been some um police cars um in my neighborhood. Yeah, I don't know um What's going on? They seem to be going, going to the, uh, to the, uh, my mom, to the, uh, back, to the, uh, back of the road. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't know what's going on. But anyway, like I said, his favorite quarterback, Stetson Bennett, not going to be there anymore. So, yeah, here's a, uh, um, a hot take. And maybe, um, yeah, yeah, here's a hot take. Yeah, the, uh, uh the Ravens draft Stetson Bennett. So that Todd Monk and Adam and Stetson Bennett can be um, reunited um, in the NFL. So anyway, and well, and uh, and now, um, 
it looks like um, Kirby is going to hire or um, promote um, Mike Bobo to um, offensive coordinator. That's right. Bobo is back. Of course, he used to be our offensive coordinator from like 2006 to um, 2014. So, and um, yeah, and our offenses were um, were um, uh, were um, really good. Uh, I mean, um, elite even sometimes uh, under um, under uh, Mike Bobo. Right, of course, he coached, you know, you know, the great, you know, UGA quarterbacks like um, Matthew Stafford and um, Aaron Murray. And then he also coached some, coached some bad quarterbacks like, um, like, uh, my mom, my mom, like um, Joe Cox and um, Hudson Mason. But, you know, but, you know, we don't, but, you know, we don't talk about them, but. Uh yeah, I think he was averaging like um forty points a game uh during his time in Athens. I know a lot of people, you know, you know, don't like, you know, Bobo. You know, you know, they think this is a they they think this is a bad hire, and maybe it is. I don't know. Maybe his you know system has um kind kind of gotten old. Maybe I don't know. I mean, I know that 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 his offenses weren't very good. At um, Auburn and um, South Carolina, but um, you know he was at South Carolina. What was that? Twenty twenty. Uh, no, I think he was. I can't remember which one he was at first, but he was like for like one year at South Carolina, and then like one year um, at Auburn. So, um. But anyway, oh yeah, and of course he also used to be the uh, head coach of um, Colorado State. So I mean, he 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 did all right for his uh for his uh, first few years, but then his last couple of years they were were terrible. So, um, but anyway, so um, yeah, it's great to have um Mike Bobo back as our offensive coordinator. Uh, cause of course I really, you know, you know, liked our offenses, uh, when, um, he was here. So, um, but anyway, so, um, yeah, so, um, my mom, thanks for watching. Uh, yeah, let me, yeah, let me know what y'all think about, uh, about Munkin leaving. Let me know what you think about, about, um, about, um, my mom, Mike Bobo being our new offensive coordinator and are and are we and are we screwed uh for this year um but anyway so let me know what you think uh, in the comments below and uh thanks for watching and i'll see y'all again next time